relationships should inspire, encourage and fire the imagination of children. And that's just what Netherfield Primary School head teacher Sharon Gray does. When pupils of Netherfield Primary turned up to school one Monday morning, they were in for a shock. With emergency services, TV crews and reporters, it was a dramatic scene. Is it safe for us to go in there? Just a second, I think we need a second opinion. <laughs> oh, oh, it's getting foggy by the minute. Get back, get back. We could see a mound and then light flashing from it, and we didn't know what was happening. In fact, the situation was an elaborate stunt arranged by head teacher Sharon Gray to get the children investigating and engaged in learning. So our year sixes became scientists and they looked into whether the, the explosion was something that had come from within the earth or something had dropped onto the earth. How excited are It completely inspired them and it made them desperate to come to school. But before Sharon arrived, Netherfield Primary, in one of the most deprived areas of Nottingham, had received notice to improve from Ofsted. There was a lot of behaviour issues. Um, children who needed extra support weren't getting that extra support. Morning. Morning! When Sharon was appointed in 2009, she immediately set about transforming the school. Club start this week. And in the four years Sharon has been in Netherfields, the school has gone from strength to strength. This year, celebrating outstanding Ofsted reports across all areas. Miss Grace just fun, kind, loving, and like my friend Jack said, she's just full of surprises. So if that one's number one, what's that one? Number two. Number two. She's got results too. The children now make outstanding progress from when they arrive to when they leave. You can come to me to collect your certificate. It's all down to Sharon's leadership and inspirational ideas, like good behaviour cards for local shops to reward well-behaved pupils. Miss Gray is life-changing. Anything and everything that we could have ever imagined for this school has come true, everything. And she, it's her that's made it possible. <laughs> Reese, the little boy who spoke, she's fun and kind and loving and full of surprises. Well, so are they. And I've got to say, I just thank you. I'm so overwhelmed with this. And I, I am so proud to be a part of Netherfield Primary School, not just the school, but the whole community and our absolutely phenomenal staff team who, with such a, a drive, seek and find the most creative solutions to overcome potential barriers to learning and, as you can see, make a difference to the lives of so many people. And then our, our parents and our carers, our volunteers and friends of the school who tirelessly support. And then, have you seen in the, the, the video, our children who are just so energetic, but it's their resilience and their perseverance and their sense of fun and engagement. And more than that, their passion for and love of learning that never fails to inspire any one of them. And I, I just feel totally privileged to be a part of their life journey. They're our future. And I just think that this award can be a reminder to everybody in Netherfield of not only everything that we've all achieved together as a team, but everything that we're going to go on to achieve in the future. We recently made the most amazing whole school song called Netherfield, Take Your Flight of Dreams. And all I can say is, Netherfield, we are going to fly high together. So thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Sharon 
has dedicated her life to the next generation. So, who better to present her award than two generations of comedy talent? Please welcome Bright Young Thing and former Pride of Britain Award winner himself, Jack Carroll, and the old-timer, Jimmy Carr. <laughs> Oh, can we, uh, turn round, Jack. What are you doing? Face the no, audience. Well, That's the first Jack. thing I teach you. Well, it's Jack, everyone. Give him a round of applause. <laughs> you're, the, you're the teacher of the year at the Pride of Britain Awards. That's an incredible achievement. Jack, how does she compare to your teachers? They didn't even make the shortlist, so that's... <laughs> that's, uh, that's you. That. We used another word earlier, but we can't transmit that on ITV. <laughs> Over a shower of something. Um, could you just... <laughs> could you talk... Cos we obviously watched that amazing film, Jack and I, and we, we, we wanted you to talk us through why you think it's OK to stage an alien invasion in a school. <laughs> Because it brings a little bit of excitement, and I think learning has got to be fun. I mean, if you're not having fun, how can you possibly truly learn and it make a difference? Fun and terrifying at the same terrifying. time. Terrifying. <laughs> no, as you saw, we had the police and all the emergency services yeah. checking out that it was completely safe. Oh, good. So that was very, very important to everybody there. You say that, I feel like you've PR'd that and they turned up. <laughs> <laughs> no, they were definitely there. Well, you are the Pride of Britain Teacher of the Year. Congratulations. Well, Yay! thank you very much. Once again, our teacher of the year, Sharon Gray.